All right, today, speaking of history, we had a high of 84 degrees, a beautiful day. 62 was our low this morning, both of those pretty close to average. And the record's 99, the record high, set back in 2001. The record low, 47, set back in 19. 89. All right, Storm Tracker 4 showing not a whole lot going on, but we are keeping an eye on a little area of showers here that's uh, coming into Santa Lake County there. We got you covered up there in the thumb, and you can see nothing violent there, no lightning uh, being reported by those. So uh, basically, we're in pretty good shape right now. There are a few more showers and storms back to the northwest, but again, this is mainly the far, far northern part of our area, the northern part of the thumb that's dealing with that rain chance tonight. All right, temperature-wise right now, 73 in Detroit, 72 at Metro Airport, 72 at Pontiac, and many other areas are upper 60s to around 70 degrees, so a little milder than it's been in recent nights. And the dew point still on the comfortable side, mostly 50s, but you'll notice that the dew point down here, uh, we're talking about Gros Seal at 74 degrees, for example, uh, that's just the marine influence. That's not the real muggy air that's coming in. Let's just kind of broaden out the view. Now you see where that moisture is down to the southwest there with widespread dew points in the 70s. That is coming our way tomorrow, and that's when you're going to really notice that sticky air coming in. So here we go with the computer model for tonight. Again, showing you those scattered showers. There's even the possibility, again, for a thunderstorm, but again, this is also I-69 or northward. Most of us have a dry, quiet night. Now, the model is not showing much generation of storms in the afternoon tomorrow, but when it's this hot and humid, you have to show respect for that. It's going to be unstable, so a pop-up shower or storm is possible. Most of us don't get one, but just be aware there could be a couple around, and then those would settle down in the evening if they were to pop up. And by the way, uh, the marginal risk for severe weather covers Sunday night into Monday. It does not get into our area. It's kind of close to the western part of the area, but overall, we're not expecting any severe weather.